Hey, what's up guys? Johnny here back with more Call of Duty Mobile. Today we talk about the crate mess up that happened earlier this week. Also how they decided to go and compensate the players who bought some crates when it was broken. If you guys don't know the whole story, this crate came out like three days ago, I think. And it was bugged, okay? So the guaranteed epics were not dropping as intended. So I realized pretty quick, I was kind of lucky or smart or whatever you want to call it but as soon as i saw it was not dropping i stopped i only bought 10 crates and i didn't get my guaranteed epic and i stopped but some guys they went ahead and they bought like 200 crates okay so not the same story for everyone but my story is i just end up buying 10 crates and that's it now the day after they removed the crate in the morning and they put it back at night at the refresh. Now, when they put it back there, it was fixed. So after that, the crates were giving the intended epics. So I decided to go and buy 30 more crates. So total, I bought 40 crates. I got the soldier, I was pretty happy. And I got five epics in 40 crates, which is uh, pretty much average. But they didn't give me my cut points back. I did check, some guys checked also in the in the video. So I didn't get refunded for the first 10 crates that I bought. And I was wondering what's gonna happen with that. So I checked my inbox today and we got a compensation. They say reinforced soldier crate compensation from system. So it just happened tonight. And they give me my 10 crates back. They don't give me my cut points back. They just give me 10 crates. So it says recently there was a configuration issue with reinforced soldier crate. We're sorry for the inconvenience you may have experienced. To assist with the issue, we're sending you free crates. Thank you for understanding. So basically, I want to check the crates, but I think they just given me 10 more of the reinforced soldier crate, which I already bought. So let's see, okay? I'm going to check my, uh, my inventory, but... I, and then I want to talk about it because for me, if it's just giving me my 10 crates, I will open 10 more crates. For me, it's not a big deal, but for some guy who opened 160 crates, they already got all the epics. And now what you're going to do, you're going to give them another 160 crates. What are they going to do with that? They already have the epics. So it's not like getting the cut points back if you give them crates again, because the crates are useless if you already have everything. But, like, yeah, it looks like I have 10 more crates, guys. I mean, it's, it's good for me because I stop and I don't have the... I mean, if I get the Fennec, that's cool. If I get the Man of War, that's cool. If I get one Epic, that's cool. But I really... I, I would like to know the guys, like, the guys who bought 100 crates or 90 or 200 crates. Did they get 200 crates back? Because that's stupid as hell. And I saw someone on Twitter, he had 30 crates. So probably he bought 30 when it was broken and they gave him another 30. But I mean, it's only good if someone did like I did and you stop buying crates. But yeah, I'm really curious and how these guys feel about it. Anyways, guys, we're going to open these 10 crates. See if the compensation's good. Because like the only problem is I didn't get a free epic in my 10 at the start. So if I get an epic now, I guess we're good, right? Thank you, Card Mobile. I'll take the the ten duplicates, one hundred sixty credits. Wow. I don't know what to say, guys. I just, I don't know, man. I don't think it was the right move. I think they should have given the card points back, and then when you have your card points back, you're free to choose what you want to do with that. Because I'm pretty sure the dudes who buy one hundred sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety crates. They would not open another 90 crates. They would just take their card points back and don't touch this crate again. But anyways, guys, uh, I'm really curious what you guys have to say about that. Let me know in the comments. Is it fair or not? Did you see other videos or other posts? Because that only one I saw was from Twitter. The guy got 30 crates. But if you saw someone with 100 plus crates, well, what happened, guys? And one more thing before I go about the soldier voice. I made a video on the crate opening video the second time. And I went into a game, tried a voice lines on that soldier, and I realized it has no voice, it's not talking. And some guys in the comments pointed out 
if your mic is not open the soldier is not going to talk so you have to open your mic pretty sure it doesn't work that way so we're going to go into a game and i'm going to show you guys with another soldier just to show you with the same settings okay so we're gonna go with charlie sinister okay look at my settings you see my mic is closed and my speaker is closed okay see impressive impressive my soldier is talking turn on voice chat okay now i'm gonna change my loadout i'm gonna go with the alien dude okay and then look i didn't change my setting not talking not talking not talking so i got called an idiot i got called a freaking donkey and all that because they say you freaking idiot your mic is closed that's why the soldier is not talking what the hell are you talking about it doesn't work like that you freaking clowns even today on stream another clown came back like this guy's an idiot his mic was closed that's why the soldier doesn't have a voice dude it doesn't work like that the soldier does not have a voice okay so i mean i don't know what else to say but the soldier came out without a voice which is pretty sad would have liked to have like a robot voice or something but maybe it's gonna come later i know it's not the only soldier without a voice and some soldiers later after release they get a voice change or but anyways that's it for today guys hope you enjoyed the video smash like if you did don't forget to subscribe for daily comable videos i will see you guys in the next one take care